making our weekly little Polaroids of the bed. Got this little box to keep some of our other Polaroids in. And I have a sonogram in here. And then I label them like how many weeks. I wore something different today though. So. <laughs> Oops. And then I have a few from the gender reveal. They're also dark, but it's okay. It's like warm. Nasty weather. It is warm. But it is gross out. Hey guys, welcome back to another vlog. I am off to the doctor's appointment. I have Matt with me. He's trying to figure out like my key fob. It needs a new battery and I don't know how to figure out what kind of battery it needs. I haven't driven my car in days and it sounds awful. That's only because it's wet. I know. And, uh... It's kind of a lake. Um, but we have our doctor's appointment today. 17 weeks as of yesterday. So baby's starting to pop. The bump is popping a little. We do our weekly photos. I never actually do it like on the day. I'm not too good at that, but um, we did 17 week photo today. We do a little Polaroid, which is just like a fun keepsake. I'm gonna start doing that every week, come like maybe 20 weeks. But right now I'm doing it every other week because I feel like I'm not changing enough in those weeks. But off to the doctor, I'm so what, excited. The Polaroids, we have, you're not yeah. gonna keep doing? For what? You're not going to keep doing the Polaroid? No, I'm going to start doing them every week instead of every other week. You have been doing them every week. No, I haven't. 13, 15, and 17. We have three of them. Goodness, I feel like I've been <laughs> taking pictures every day. Um, so, that's that. What else was I just about to say? Oh, we haven't been to the doctor since December 28th. So, it's been like a long time. At least it feels like a long time. And I'm just excited Almost to go. A month. I know. And then our next appointment is the 20 week anatomy scan, which is going to be a really fun one. So I'm super excited. Every doctor's appointment, I always like to schedule them like late and then make like a little date night out of it. So we're going to do Chick fil A for dinner. And then I have some errands to run. Tomorrow I'm leaving for my cousin's bachelorette trip. So I think I may include that just like in this vlog because there's a bunch of girls that like I'm not. I don't even know going and I'm not going to shove a camera in their face, but maybe I'll get some clips and just include it in this vlog. But we are going to the Poconos and we have a really cool cabin, like hot tub, sauna, and we're doing a winery, which is all things I can't do, but I'm, in, I'm excited to, okay, cool. Take a photo of it, maybe. I'm excited to be going and having a fun little girls weekend, you know? So he got the car key undone and <laughs> smooth oh my god the car is gonna stop working oh my god matt <laughs> um but yeah that's a little update i haven't vlogged in a while did i even vlog over the weekend yes i did but today's thursday now so it's been quite some time i feel like i haven't updated you guys in so long so got some things going on but i'll see you guys when we get to the doctor's literally took so long just about two hours we were in there Yippers. ridiculous i ended up having to get blood work for spina bifida i think it was for no terabithia <laughs> um so got unexpected blood work and i'm starving i haven't eaten like most of the day so i feel like i'm gonna how many die. bowels did they fill just one so not too much blood at least so not gonna crash um but um, we got to see the baby again, which we were not expecting. We actually made a bet, Matt and I. He said we would, and I said we wouldn't. So I'm paying for Chick Fil A now. So we're about to go to Chick Fil A. Well, also the nurse came in and said, "Yeah, she's like, I'll have the ultrasound machine right here in case she wants to use it, but yeah. she usually doesn't at this yeah. point." And then, so I was like, "Oh, Matt, and then I won." Yeah, Sarah was 
bragging about how I'm gonna have to pay for dinner and then although it doesn't matter I mean it's just the same money it just <laughs> it doesn't depends matter on whose at all. credit card we put it on but uh but yeah yeah, and then the lady came in and goes, I'm gonna put this in here. She actually said she wants to do it because she feels bad that we waited for so we long. We waited for so, so long. She's like, oh, you could just see the baby. You guys can see the baby. <laughs> um, which I appreciate, like I wanted to see the baby, so I'm happy about it. I just didn't think we were gonna be seeing the baby. But heartbeat was good, everything still seemed good. And we scheduled our 20 week anatomy scan for um, the 19th of February. We we were supposed to do it on the 14th, which is Valentine's Day. That's exactly 20 weeks. And they were booked for like the rest of that week. So didn't really work out the way I wanted it to work out. Cause that would have been a fun like little Valentine's date. But the next yeah. Monday we'll see the baby and maybe we'll do like date night that like we'll do something after that too. So yeah, I'm just starving now. It's been a long day. Long day of sitting in there, that's for sure. Mm -hmm. It is 7.30. We, we literally left the house at 3.45. So this is crazy. It's been like a long, long day. But I'll quickly show you what we got. The first thing is the cutest thing. Little Demi baby fans. How <laughs> cute are they? So I got a 0.3 because that will be perfect. Summertime, they were $4. So I don't have any shorts for the baby yet. So I figured I'd get them. They're $1. What? You said they're $4 in the summer and now they're 3 no, I said they're four dollars, and I said I don't have, I didn't get, I haven't bought many baby shorts, so I thought they were good to buy. I'll show you what we got really quick, really quick run through. Chow mein, stir fry cup noodle, and then two other cup noodles. I don't know why I've been like kind of wanting them lately, and usually do not eat those. I can't tell you like, I had one earlier this week, but before that it was probably like college. Um, I got a bunch of marshmallow s'more making material, like graham crackers, two boxes of graham crackers. I did that by accident, by the way, that was me. Um, how to get flour and rice. A um, bunch of things of chocolate, angel hair and pasta sauce. We are doing spaghetti and meatballs on Sunday, homemade meatballs. I haven't done homemade meatballs in a very long time. And then Matt is doing steak while I'm gone. So he got like steak sauce, marinade, and I had to get Tums. I've been needing Tums badly. The heartburn when I eat spicy things is like out of this world, but yeah, Tums. And then, I'll show you the rest over here. Sausage and beef. I mix these for my meatballs. Welsh's, I love these things. Baked ruffles and then an onion for our meatballs too. So that's everything we picked up. Somehow it was $100, it does not feel like a lot of things. But this is this and I'm gonna put it away really quick. And Matt is gonna be leaving us soon for his little basketball boys thing he does on Thursdays. So. I'm gonna have some me time. I actually have to work on a YouTube video and get it ready for tomorrow. So I'm gonna be leaving work early tomorrow to go on the trip. But I also bought this strawberry lemonade because my cousins really like this at the gender reveal. Um, and it's her, her bachelorette. So I figured I'd pick it up for them. Uh, I'm gonna pack everything into this bag that I'm gonna be bringing with me. I think I'm also gonna bring a bag of popcorn and chips. Cause they said just like bring snacky foods. Just showered up and washed the hair, oiled the body, did the whole nine yards. And now I'm starting to pack. So I know I'm gonna bring this dress. I wear this dress so often. It's from Shein. And it's just like this long body tight dress. So I'm gonna wear this to the winery on Saturday. I am so out of breath, it's like painful. And then I think I'm gonna throw this sweater over it. It's like a really long jumper sweater. Like, I love this thing. Very long. And now I'm trying to decide what I wanna wear the other days. I think I might bring this sweatshirt. I 
brown sweatshirt and just like some yoga pants for Sunday probably because we'll be coming home Sunday and it's already starting to like pill up I feel like the sweatshirt um but this will be I'm gonna say a Sunday and I'll bring like my pink Kalara yoga pants too so that's that okay. so I'll wear my pink yoga pants with the brown sweatshirt and honestly that's kind of it maybe i'll pack like a pair of cozies but i always have this with me i keep this in my like travel bag and it's just a bunch of like my minis my shampoo conditioner body lotion i have like body belly butter in my bag too from like pregnancy stuff toothpaste toothbrush face wash face lotion all always right in this bag and i just refill stuff as i need but i'm just gonna throw this in there a pair of pajamas i'll need Two I'm going to have clean. Probably bring these purple ones. Let's see if I have any fun ones in here. I'll bring my black ones actually. Good morning. I haven't done my makeup or hair. I literally didn't even brush it yet today, so don't mind me. I look a little crazy lately, but I'm heading out. I finished my work day <clears throat> a little bit ago. Today is the day we're leaving for my cousin's bachelorette party, and we're going to be leaving in like two hours, a little less, so I'm going to run out and grab lunch, and I have to pick something up from the grocery store for Matthew, and get some gas, and that's about it, so I'm going to run a few errands, get myself in order and like actually look a little bit more presentable before we head out okay <laughs> tell me why i've been craving popeyes this is so i mean kind of out of the ordinary for me like i occasionally do like popeyes oh my god look at this fry it's just a small fry the fries are good <laughs> they taste so overly fried though like, they had the oil taste, which is not the best. But they're good. And I got a chicken sandwich, even though I had one last night. It's a lot of fries. I'm gonna end up bringing a lot of these home for Matt. Because that's insane. Okay, I'm about to head out for the weekend. I have this little present for my cousin. Nothing special, it's like a picture frame. And um, a little like bandana that says bride or like headband thing that says bride with a little veil. So I thought that was cute. I'm gonna do that. She asked me to bring my tripod, which I don't know where it is right now. I'm gonna look for that for a second. And I honestly don't know where I could have put it, which might be an issue. Okay, I see a tripod. Just got to the Airbnb. It's so cute. They're setting up their little things. Everyone has shots. And mine, of course, is an immunity <laughs> shot. <laughs> it's so cute, Still though. <laughs> I'll take it with you guys whenever you take your shot. This is probably worse than vodka, though, to be honest. <laughs> but it's so cute. Do you care what works? And here's, like, the living room. Some bedrooms down here. This is Tyra and Tressa's. And I'm going to stay in here. And, of course, this is the one with the grip. <laughs> um, I'm not going to vlog too much this weekend, but I'll show you a little bit here and there. back home we got home like four hours ago and i've been relaxing showered doing some laundry and now we're making meatballs for dinner so matt did the whole um mixture and he's now washing his hands because he's all grossed out but we do <laughs> yeah the football game's on so he wants me to roll them into balls now but we did one pound of ground beef one pound of italian sausage 
half cup of breadcrumbs, half cup of Parmesan cheese, two eggs, onion, and some seasoning. So I'm gonna roll it into balls now. Here's our mixture. And I'm gonna see how many meat this makes. This is a big portion, so we'll have a lot to freeze. Shrunk down once they're cooked. Falling to pieces in my room. Are you coming over? That's cool. I could use a little something to do. We could go outside, take a little ride if you want to. 